Today, the monsoon session of the Lok Sabha began on a chaotic note with the opposition preventing Prime Minister Narendra Modi from introducing his newly inducted union ministers to the House. PM Modi had to abandon the exercise midway amid sloganeering against price rise and farmer protests by the opposition. Defence Minister Rajnath Singh said such a thing was happening for the first time in his 24 years of parliamentary career. On the other hand, Pegasus Project reports, which had stated that 300 mobile numbers in India including that of journalists, politicians and business persons are part of a leaked database of numbers that may have been selected for surveillance, also dominated discourse with IT Minister Ashwini Vaishnav saying in the Lok Sabha that the claims made were part of an effort to undermine Indian democracy and its institutions. The second dose of Bharat Biotech's co-vaccine for children aged 2 to 6 years is likely to be administered to those participating in the trials next week. Sources at AIMS added that the second dose of co-vaccine has already been given to children between ages of 6 to 12 years. Earlier, AIMS Director Dr. Randeep Guleria said the vaccine for children could likely be available in the country in September. Amid the ongoing military standoff with China in eastern Ladakh, Indian agencies are closely monitoring the development of a Chinese airbase in Shakchi. Once developed, this military base could strengthen China's hand along the line of actual control. Senior government sources said the Shakchi airbase is being rapidly developed further into a military airbase fit for fighter operations. These developments precede the military standoff triggered between the Indian Army and the PLA last year. Today, Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal said that a world-class drainage system will be developed across the national capital. He said drainage systems like the one at Minto Road will be replicated across Delhi. The Chief Minister made the announcement after taking part in a review meeting on the city's drainage system with officials from Public Works Department, Civic Bodies, Delhi Jal Board and Irrigation and Flood Control. The meeting was chaired by Lieutenant Governor Anil Baijal.